You can have it. Baby, say, now stay woke. People creeping, but don't you close your eyes. Too late. I wanna make you something, but it's too late. My peanut butter chocolate mixed with Kool Aid. I'm trying not to waste your time. <laughs> Oh it's your boy RDR and welcome back to RDR Food Reviews and today I'm doing a break in chain here on the fast on, on the RDR Food Review and so you know I've always been doing you know a bunch of fast food you know nothing but some good fast food good old fast food you know what I'm saying just some good greasy juicy cheesy whatever burgers and stuff but now today I'm switching it up it's time to do something light and right and today I slid over to Panera Breads you know, uh, Panera Bread, and I wanted to do something different, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to lighten it up a little bit on the on the channel, but I come back a little bit with some more healthy reviews, and so today I'm doing a review on the, I think it's the Roasted and Avocado BLT sandwich, and uh, so it's time to go ahead and get it in. Just give me one second to pull out this uh, the sandwich, and we're going to see what Panera Bread is talking about, all right? One sec. Pow. All right, here we go. And this right here is the B, the, the Roasted Turkey BLT. And it came with some chips, but I'm not gonna rock with the chips. You know, it was the first, honestly, it was like my first time going to Panera Breads. Uh, I haven't been there. And, you know, I kind of got threw off when it came with uh, do you want like the half and the whole or whatnot. But I got the full sandwich, but I'm only gonna eat half of it. And so, what's in this, uh, let me go ahead and pull it out, pause. All right. Oh man, looks sexy to my mother. Yeah, look at that. Mm. Look at that. Is that not absolutely sexy? All right, right here. No, I don't think this might be it right here. So, what's in this um, roasted turkey and avocado sandwich, which I got it pressed right there. This is, the half sandwich is, um, first I'm gonna tell you what's in it. You got roasted turkey, raised without antibiotics, applewood, smoked bacon, lettuce, vine ripe tomatoes, avocados, pure mayonnaise, and salt and pepper on sourdough. So, like I said, this right here is the roasted turkey BLT. And oh yeah, before I jump into this, let me go ahead and get a quick moment of prayer. Give it up to the Father. Father, thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. Help this food nourish my body, make it strong as a person, strong as a man, and bless those that grow hungry. I pray that you please find them something in your holy, gracious, mighty name, glorious name, I pray. Amen. Thank you. All right. So, so oh, came with a pickle, too. It's so thoughtful. All right. So, without further ado, the new, nah, but not the new. I got so used to always breaking in something new, you know what I mean? The the roasted turkey and avocado BLT. Mm. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Mm. Bear with me. Bear with me. This right here. It's such a fresh, fresh sandwich. When the first thing I noticed, macaroni. When I bit into the bacon, you can taste the, the smokiness of the bacon. I like, I'm very, I'm glad that I put it, I got it pressed. You know, the sourdough pressed or whatnot. You see the marks on the panini. The chicken is absolutely delicious. Look at that chicken right there. Mm. It just has a different taste to it compared to just eating chi like regular chicken slices or whatnot. Say so like, for instance, the chicken that you would get from Subway or whatnot. But man, the avocado is creamy. It's very much, oh goodness, slipped out. It's, it's very much complimenting the avocado, I mean the, uh, the, the mayonnaise. The avocado and the mayonnaise, the creaminess of both of them are just, it's like playing ping pong off each other. Mm. 
Absolutely happy. I'm gonna kill this baby right here. The bacon is. I'm loving that smokiness of that bacon. The tang of that tomatoes come from a straight different world. Like, I don't know. It's just weird. And I can't believe I just destroyed that puppy like that. Pickle bite. Scrum deliciousness. But man, that right there was an absolutely great treat. But if I had, if, if you wanted to eat the whole, the calories, the whole sandwich of the, the roasted turkey, um, avocado BLT, it's um, it's 650 calories. And um, you can see that, let me turn this around. But just for a half, it's 320. So if you are definitely watching your calories, and um, and that's something that you're very much, I mean, you're watching your caloric deficit, your, your calorie deficit for the days. Um, it's two, it, for the half is 320 calories. And then it's got, and 150 of it is from fat. Of course, it's like 17 grams, but it's the good fat from mostly from the, uh, the avocados and then a little bit for the mayonnaise. But if you don't want to get mayonnaise, it's good to cut that out too. Uh, it's 19 grams of protein and the carbs is 25 grams. So. I think that is excellent. Of course, like I said, it comes with the chips. I've never ever tried their chips before. One wouldn't hurt. The whole bag is 150. Let me go ahead and get a little crunch action going on. It's just the original kettle Panera bread chips. Um, just your normal kettle chips, but man, I feel really, really good that I came to Panera Breads today. Fresh, new on the channel. I mean, for that sandwich, for the whole sandwich, for a whole sandwich of the the, the roasted turkey avocado BLT, it came out to like 1079. It was not, not like 1079, it's like 10 something. But it said it was 979, but it cost course tax, it came out to be 10. So it's quite a little bit expensive, but you gotta understand, it's a lot of fresh organic ingredients that go into the products that they put out. And you know what was even funny about Panera Breads? Um, they were shooting sniper shots at uh, Chick-fil-A and uh, Starbucks for using their, quote, hockey hockey puck eggs or whatnot. Hot, their fake, uh, they call it their fake eggs or whatnot. Saying they, 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 they serving us some, some frozen hockey puck eggs or whatnot. <sighs> Refreshing. So, I can't wait. Would I come back to Panera Breads? Yes, absolutely. But I definitely want to try their breakfast and see what they're talking about in that aspect. But uh, I definitely would come go back to Panera Breads again. So thank you everybody for watching my Panera Breads taste test. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up. If you don't like it, hit that thumbs down. I'm gonna be hitting you guys more often with some more healthy reviews. I think it's more better for the channel and it gives a little break off of some greasy stuff you know, every once in a while because I know I got a lot of people out there that eat very, very healthy on my channel and they want to see some good hype and good uh, healthy uh, reviews like when I first started. So it's coming to you guys and this is a kicker. So thank you guys for watching. As I always say, food is a gift, so please, food is a gift, so please give thanks. It's your boy RDR and I'm signing out. God bless y'all. Take care already. I love you guys and I'll see you soon. I love you. God bless.